What we're gonna do right now is we're gonna go over an under drag. It's a great way, right, to create separation off an aggressive defender, right, when I'm either going downhill or at an angle. All right, so right now, Jordan Poole uses it, right, to attack to the baseline. So what he does, Damian Lillard is on his high side. Right, that offensive player is going to clear right through the weak side and that's another major key as an offensive player if i see them high side here right if i'm here i just want to clear right through right unless i'm a, a shooter maybe where it's, they're going to stay locked on that shooter and i can get downhill with your under drag as you attack you want to keep that motion almost like you're running right so if i was to start here and i was to run i would take these steps right you want those same steps right as you're going into your under drag that's going to sell that drive downhill and force this defender to sprint to try to cut you off right a lot of the times right when players are training they know they're going under drag okay as they rep it so they start to stop on this foot right and then they pull their chest back and then they hit their foot, which now pulls them back, and that ball's gonna float on them. You wanna be here on that, loaded. This is your stop. This is your anchor to create space. And then you wanna pull that ball under, right? As that defender goes here, you're floating. I drag under, right? And then I'm back. Okay, so what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna go under drag. What Jordan Poole does is he toe taps. His toe tap is gonna create a little more separation and it's also gonna get him behind that three-point line. So as he drags here under, right, Damian Lillard obviously goes right down here under his frame. He's gonna toe tap, that's gonna get him balanced, right, that's gonna create more separation, and it's gonna put him behind that line, right? Three major keys with this move. Now with our toe tap, right, the, the biggest thing that everybody's been saying the past few years is travel 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 right the rule is if the ball right or if you have the ability to put the ball back on the ground right to attack right you have those steps so what I mean by that is if I drag right and that ball's floated as I tap right I still can go through the legs and attack back downhill so the ball's gonna float right I want to load on this foot this is my toe tap Okay, so I want to be light, which is going to allow me to then push off, right, light, and then I want to pick up as my left foot, right foot is coming down. Okay, so again, the ability to hang the ball, right, allowing my feet, right, to do whatever I need to do to either create space or maybe to counter a move, right, and having that ability to put that ball back down is going to be key right here. A lot of times we go here, right, and we see people right players pick it up here and then they start to push back into it that's where you get called to travel we want to come here toe tap right and then i pick up with that right hand as that foot is hitting <laughs> <laughs>